if I think about it, I think that, um, you know, I don't think it's too bad, but I think I would like to be able to um, plan better and make more goals so that I can achieve more. I would say um, time and probably knowledge when it comes to making and creating food. Like I know what's good to eat, but then it's just creating meals, nutritious meals to be able to have that. But um, yeah, time and probably knowledge would be food. It's a challenge of just having the time to be able to make um, good meals. Well, I'm a bit of a, an emotional eater, so I often turn to food, particularly sweet stuff. Um, so if I'm feeling negative or in a bad mood, um, I tend to go to chocolate or whatever, sweet treat, doesn't matter. Um, I started the challenge three days ago, so I'm currently eating pretty good. But before that, um, I don't feel like I overate, but um, I probably chose the wrong foods to eat. Normally I would run two to three times in the week, and then after that I would use a free app on my phone to do just home workouts in my garage. Well, Nate gave me an awesome opportunity to do it and um, told me about it and um, I just loved his enthusiasm and energy to get on it and change some things in my life. It would be to um, lose some weight, definitely. I'd love to lose at least five kilos, but um, mostly to change my mindset with food so I can um, eliminate that emotional eating. Hi, here we are at the end of week three, beginning of week four, and just checking in to see how I'm feeling. Um, so energy levels are awesome, just feeling really light and um, you know, quick on the toes. <laughs> the food is fantastic, I'm really enjoying it. Um, haven't had any bloating, which is awesome, but loving the um, meal ideas and things that other members, um, other challenges put on our, the Facebook page. So it's really um, inspirational and gives you a great um, focus on where you can go with your food. Um, sessions, I'm currently doing two per week because it's a bit hard to get to lots of them due to family. But um, just love the energy for each session. Um, Nate is awesome. He's so energetic and so um, yeah, alive. Makes you feel alive and like you can do anything. So that's really good too. And loving the other um, challenges as well. They're so supportive and um, just inspirational as well. Loving it. Um, the more I find that the active I am and the more outdoors and doing things, um, the happier I am rather than just sitting around doing nothing. Food. <laughs> um, but I most definitely feel like, and that probably goes into next my biggest challenge, is um, food. But I most definitely feel like um, I've learnt a lot on this challenge with um, food and what I can eat and what's good for me and it's been great. It would have to be better than it was. Um, I think learning about what I can have um, has been a huge help and you know knowing that I can have rice at dinner time was awesome. I'm still trying to stick to the plan of the ultimate eight because I would still like to um, lose a few more kilos. I'm currently doing five days a week so I like to have a couple of rest days in there. Um, a way to kickstart me into my health and fitness journey it was most definitely changed my mindset um, on food and healthy living and I feel like I've started that and the journey is well on its way. So yeah. <laughs> Most definitely I'm going to keep what I've learnt. I definitely want to incorp um, keep incorporating it into my life and hopefully um, it will slowly um, filter into my family. Um, my girls have already started to want to eat more salads and that so that's been great. Um, I think that this is um, one of the most amazing group of people with Fit Stuff and Elite. Um, the people just support you and love you and um, just include you and they're, they're such an inspiration alone and so most definitely would look at doing one again. Would be pretty average. Um, I've got two little kids and I work decent hours and I don't get Oh, I blame time for 
not being able to do a lot of things and eat properly and exercise. Uh, just being addicted to all sorts of nasty stuff, uh, energy drinks mainly, is probably gonna find, be finding time to come to gym. Got a pretty average relationship with food. I love greasy food. So I'm hoping that I can get into meal prepping and I don't eat well at all, at all. Not even remotely anything good. So this will be a good, good thing for me. I don't exercise at all, but I do have a pretty physical job. So I sort of count that as exercise. I didn't technically sign up for the Ultimate 8. I won it. At first I was pretty, pretty worried and I was a bit scared, but I'm pretty pumped to, to do it and see the results. To change my lifestyle and try and get my food eating better. Midway and I do feel better, heat's better actually. Um, I've been unlucky with some sickness and I haven't trained for a solid week, but this week we've been getting to, I've been to six sessions. So, um, I feel heat's better. We did a run at EP and I beat my fitness test run, so I'm obviously improving. Um, food's good, Staying to the, I'm sticking to the plan. Um, it's heaps easier than I thought it was gonna be and the food's still good, so. I actually feel more motivated and I actually enjoy going to gym and doing stuff now instead of just sitting on the couch doing nothing. Well, there isn't really a barrier, it's just getting in the right mindset to go and do the stuff and, and eat well and do the exercise. My biggest challenge was definitely myself and my uh, laziness, I suppose. Um, but I've learned to enjoy it and I actually, like I do enjoy it, so. I don't really have any challenges now. Has improved heaps. Um, I never really ate that bad dinner wise because I've got kids and I want them to eat healthy, but um, just the foods that I eat during the day and, and making myself eat has made a massive impact. Way better than I did eight weeks ago. Way more than I did eight weeks ago. Um, like I said, I actually enjoy coming to the gym now and. I get cut when I can't make it. I didn't really sign up, I won it. And I had no intentions of doing it. And then when I got here and started doing it, I enjoyed it and I'd recommend it for sure. Well, I think I achieved my goal. I didn't really have the weight to lose, but I'm definitely a fitter and stronger person for it. Keep going with it. Um, it's really not that hard. So it turns out to get to gym and eat well and I've enjoyed it and I'll, I'll keep doing it for sure.